All of us, you know it's me and from nobody That was on purpose. <laughs> that that was on purpose. Wait, are we in the? Am I in the frame right? Is the camera right? Yeah, you're right. Look, it's just because we have the this in there. See? Oh, uh, okay. I feel like uh, I did move it the other day. So, welcome back, Pez collectors. You gotta move my coffee here because I can't mouse properly. <laughs> We're just beginning, Greg. Can't, can't. Uh, I'm trying to get. I'm trying to move away. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm hot. Oh. Dying. There's a better. Oh, there. In case you don't know, it is 1,000 degrees outside, <laughs> and it's only 999 degrees inside our house right now. <laughs> Whew. Uh, well, thanks, to everybody, for joining us today on your Saturday. Hopefully, you're drinking some coffee. Ooh, look at our battery power. Did I plug it in? Oh no, it goes off at night, oh. so it should be fine. Okay. We're good. We're good. Worry. We're good. We're good. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> Sienna, first comment. Hey, good morning, Sienna. Good morning. How are you? Always nice that you can join us on the live streams. <laughs> oh, here we go. Where uh, is where is my Smurfs box you were supposed to oh, sell me? <laughs> Tell Greg one thing you never will forget. <laughs> Chubby Checker. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Ooh. My, uh, I have my phone ringer on because my sister went to an estate sale. Should we tell them? Oh, that's fine. <laughs> Buying us some Pez. And, uh, there was actually an estate sale here, not too far away, that they were, someone was a Pez collector, I guess, and they actually went to like the St. Louis Pez convention. It looked like maybe two years they had the t-shirts and they had a small, a very small collection of vintage Pez. And then they had a whole bunch of, you know, more current stuff from like, yeah. maybe like late nineties, two thousands. But- uh, Let me say good morning to Carol so I can close this. Yeah. Good morning, Carol. All good right, morning, back to your Carol. story. Back to your story. <laughs> I didn't know you were getting ready to go into a whole story when I was uh. just, just clicking on good mornings. <laughs> I mean, well, I'm looking at the, here, looking at the itinerary. Early, you get the good stuff, yeah, so I you mean, don't want to miss out. Yeah, I'm looking at the itinerary here. It doesn't have this on the schedule, so go ahead, <laughs> but go ahead with your story. Want me to roll you out the door? <laughs> yeah, I could take a Saturday off. It wouldn't hurt my feelings. Oh, this is so much fun. I know. Sometimes I'm like, well, do we need to do it every Saturday? But then I'm like, well, it's so much fun. Yeah, I know. It is super fun. <laughs> so go back to your story. Oh. So, yeah, so was, there was a bunch of Pez. Like, they had a whole room full of Pez sitting out on tables and stuff. And it was just fun. Like, I wasn't expecting to find anything like that. And then I was like, I told my sister, I'm like, you gotta go. You gotta go check this out because she lives close to me and as well. So, yep. her, and her, her and Jack, my nephew I talk about all the time here, you've seen him on the channel. They went over there and they shopped for us. And I think they're getting themselves some stuff too. So, it's fun. Yeah, so I... So two things. I, I haven't quite figured out if she's going to buy the stuff that I want and then sell it to me at ah! retail price or if I actually bought it at the Don't price. Don't give her any ideas. They watch this. <laughs> so I'm a little uncertain because she's like, you know, how much for this? And I'm like, oh, that's 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 full price. That is full. Go ahead and buy it. But that's full price. <laughs> then then I had a sad thought. Maybe that you need I, to pay her a little extra just for going over there for us. I told I tell people I mean, that I, I think would. I would. They like going to stuff like that anyway. I don't. They don't usually go to estate sales, but they like to go to garage sales and look for fun stuff. Especially because Jack's younger, he likes to look for fun stuff. Yeah, I I had a sad thought that 
didn't seem like there was a single Pez in their Pez room after the Pez convention in St. Louis closed down. That was the last Pez in there. Leading, they had, they had cool Pez Man t-shirts and what? and then it was just over one day. Over. When the Pez convention ended, whoever that person was just said, just packed it up, packed up the Pez apron. I don't know if that's true. Good morning, John. <laughs> I see that he's on the live stream. <laughs> I don't know if that's true, but they did have a bunch uh, of uh, St. Louis Pez Convention merch, which I thought was really fun. Yeah, they had... Uh, but nothing nothing current. The Psychedelic Hand shirt and... Uh, was it a pet... Was it Pez Pal? It was like Bride and Groom Pez Pal? I don't know, something. I think yeah. they have merch. I can't remember now. Yeah, I can't remember. But <laughs> I thought that was cool. It's not just that you're a Pez collector. You also went to the conventions. <laughs> that's a real Pez collector there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pat says, good morning, us two. Cool down. We're trying to. The uh, we, went on a, we went on a walk this morning, and then we hung out by the pool a little bit, and then got all excited <laughs> looking at Pez and estate sales, and then here we are. So that was the series of events uh, so far in our morning. This is the first time I've sat down for yeah. a couple hours. We gave, uh, <laughs> gave, had to give Clover her antibiotic. Oh, yeah. So... Can't forget that. Yeah. Clover's doing really well, too. Yeah, where's I mean, she at? I, I think she is. I put her in my office. Oh, yeah. That's who wants to be in there anyway. Yeah. She likes to eat, and then she goes and hangs out in her little bed, so she's fine. The man, the myth, the legend. <laughs> Morning, John. Creating Pez Collectors, and then... Who oh, knows? hey. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? You're gonna make them have a single man tier. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. Got me all riled up this morning looking at Pez, so who knows what's gonna happen. This live stream's gonna be crazy. <laughs> Usually Greg rolls out of bed and, and comes up here. No, Today but, he's got like, we, 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 All right, let's look at this Pez. We worked out. We had some fun. We talked about Pez, shopped for Pez, and then we came up here. Now you ha you're like just a little bit more awake. Yeah. This is my first coffee though. Uh, mm-hmm. Uh-huh. No pressure, Trekker. Oh. Uh. Honestly. If you don't want to sell it, you don't have to sell it. But we would buy it because we do have a Smurfs floor shipper box mm. that needs to be filled up with some Smurfs. I have other stuff in it, too, so don't worry about it. It's fine. <laughs> Where's the estate sale? Might have to leave you and go. I will no. buy it all for you. Oh, see? She's going to buy it all for us. Don't leave that. Don't leave the live stream. <laughs> You'll miss out on all the fun. Oh, jeez. Yeah, this... this uh, It's in Baldwin. I yeah. can send you the link. It's very close to... It's actually pretty close to you, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. John says it ran for 22 years. I would say a 22-year stint is is more than adequate for the pest community i mean people time. don't even work at the same jobs yeah. for 22 years you know like that is a commitment yeah unbelievable unbelievable so thank you john for doing that because uh i know it's a lot of fun memories for me when just aaron and i were dating oh yeah which is <laughs> you know john's got pictures of that I oh, guess yeah. before we were married, I'm sitting at the bingo, like not even had no idea what I'm doing there. <laughs> like I'm just like wanting to hang out with Aaron, and I remember she used to make. That's me how I knew he was a keeper because he went to the Pez convention with me. <laughs> she used to make me room hop until I seriously thought my <laughs> no. feet were gonna break off. I'm like, I'm like, Aaron, it's midnight. Like, are are we supposed to be like walking around the halls of this hotel? <laughs> no, because you would work all day. And sometimes, like maybe I remember one year, I think you were like super busy, and you had because he he used to do stuff. Like all day, and then they would have like installs at night or something. Mm -hmm. And then so I think I think you knew that was the Pez Commission was coming up, so you you know you made sure you didn't have to work that night, especially like on a Friday night. And then uh, we went room hopping, and I remember you were like exhausted, and you're like I'm so tired, and you were like I'll, and I was like Are you okay or whatever, and you're like I'm fine. And you just kept going, <laughs> but you were just like so tired. Yeah. Cause like when you go, I think I don't like nowadays. It seems like Pez Conventions are like Wednesday. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and then like people don't leave till like Sunday. But like 
the St. Louis Pest Convention, I don't know, maybe it was because we were here, I don't know, but we never went before, did we go on Thursday or did we go on Friday? Like, we never went, like, I remember, like, going after work. Bingo and, like, was always the first first thing you showed like, up for. I feel like it, yeah. It's yeah. so, like we would go for bingo on Friday night, and then you would have to room hop, and then you go home and sleep, and you'd be so tired from room hopping and bingo, and you get up early and go to the convention for the show on Saturday morning. Yeah. I just remember because, like, you know, we didn't <laughs> live together, so I'd be, she would want to get get up and get to that thing as oh, yeah. early as possible. So <laughs> after being there till midnight, like you lived in my work, away. in my work clothes and shoes and like all that stuff, then, then I'd be like, okay, what time is it? 6 a.m. All right. I better go up there. I'm like, I'm just gonna buy some more pests. <laughs> oh. This is, this must be uh there must be a syndrome for my Pez collecting now. Like it's just, <laughs> Like my psyche is just broken and given up. And now, I'm, <laughs> now I'm just into it. Yeah, Aaron, I love I love Pez. It's really, uh, it's really, it's really great. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> he still goes to Pez conventions with me. He might complain a little bit about oh, how tire, tiring they are if you walk around a lot and shop for Pez, but um, he always goes. Yeah, yeah, we go. Now, now that I buy stuff that I want, like nor, nor, <laughs> it's not as fun when, when you're trying to remember all the things that Aaron wants, Oh, <laughs> you know, and, uh, but now that I, now that I have stuff that I actually want, um, yeah. it's a little bit more fun. Yeah, it makes it fun. But we're planning on being in, uh, Michigan. So if you're planning on being on Mich at, at Michigan, we should, uh, meet up. Oh yeah. 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 We can room hop in an entourage. Because <laughs> that would be some good filming. You can be, uh, on the, you can be in one of Aaron's videos. If you want to be in a video, let me know. Otherwise, we'll ask. <laughs> yeah. Or I he might ask. be a background character. Well, if we go to like your room in the room hopping movies, ask. So. Yeah. Do you want to be in the, in the video or do you want to be an NPC? <laughs> <laughs> no one wants to be an NPC, so... <laughs> I'm going to be like, hey, just act like you're looking at Puzz. Yeah, you, you, yeah, yeah. Just just move your arm up and down like this, looking at Puzz. <laughs> you're holding the magnifying glass. You're like you're looking at something. <laughs> we should buy, we should buy like a case of these things and sell them. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I just feel like it wouldn't be worth it. Worth then, doing. uh, I won't say it. I won't say it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Amazon sent us a little nasty gram. Um, it's like... We've noticed unusual activity on your account <laughs> coming from places you've not mentioned. I'm just like, uh. <laughs> so now I got to make sure we list every Did you place do it where yet? we. No, you were supposed uh, to. I can do it. I didn't know I was supposed to do it. You know where all you put all these links, not me. Why is this like super crooked? Is this sitting on something? <laughs> it must be. There's probably a pez under there. Probably some <laughs> poor vintage. It's fine. Don't touch it. Holding up the holding up the whole works. <laughs> Uh, here we go. Sid, see, Sid's, Sid's my jam right here. Like, I have coffee, chili, egg, keto, frittata. That what? sounds so good. Did you make me one? Pile of boxes. His boxes rival our boxes oh, yeah. this week. Minis and cockatoo ready to go. Hey, <laughs> I gotta stop talking to these people online. They're <laughs> buying the same stuff as us. Sid. He's just gonna put it in a box, too. He's not even gonna look at it. He's gonna be like... Oh, cockatoo. Put in a well, box. You can get him out and enjoy him whenever he wants. He's going to put him in a box and never look at him again. And then I'll ask him a question and I'll have to dig through his stuff to, fi to find it for me. <laughs> uh, I haven't eaten anything, so. Yeah, me too. Hopefully I make it through the live stream. <laughs> <laughs> Chubby says, my memory is so bad. I'm getting old. Man, me too. I My memory... My memory used to be unbelievable. It still is pretty good. And now... You it, always remember, like, weird things. <laughs> like, little stuff. Like, details on stuff. And that's I'm right. like, what? That's right. And, like, every uh, week I have to ask you how to plug this in. <laughs> that, that's frustrating. I just want to... <laughs> now I know. <laughs> that's frustrating. Now I know, Grant. Aaron, Aaron reminded know. me. We made, a, we made this... Uh, we made this like a little Pez stand that you saw in Aaron's last video. We made it like an hour and a 
just to, just to do the Barky Brown thing. And she goes, she goes, remember that time when any time I would ask you to make me something, you would make me go out there and learn the tools and oh. do all the stuff. I go. Yeah, that was uh, that was Victor. Huh? That was Victor. What was Victor? He was ratcheting something for us. Oh, wife. I know. Well, that's what that's what. <laughs> Oh, that's what reminded you, not the thing. Yeah. Well, anyway, I'm like, <laughs> it must not stuck. Because uh, you, because one time you, well, I knew how to do it, but like there's like a little screw thing on the top, and you were like, you do it this way, and then you made me do it. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to try to get you to use tools because. No, I know how to use a lot of tools. No, I know, but like you needed to be, like you got lots of power tools and stuff, and like that way you can go out there power and build tools. stuff if you want, you know, <laughs> like you can do it without me. Not because I won't be here, but because I'll be inside letting you do your thing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Now get Caitlin and Jack over here to use the power tools. Oh, look <laughs> at this. Did the estate sale have crystal canines? No. No, no they did not. No. Or did they? <laughs> You'll never know. No, they didn't. <laughs> They did not. They, like, estate sales nowadays, they take tons of photos and they'll put them on their, like, estate website or whatever it's called. And uh, you could see, like, all of them. And then when my yeah. sister was there, I made her, I had her FaceTime me and uh, pan around a little bit. And not unless uh, I didn't see them, but I didn't see anything, like, super, super cool like that. But it was fun. Yeah. And the tuna is here. Oh, Sunshine, sunshine Tuna. Sunshine Tuna. <laughs> she was gone last week, wasn't she? Yeah. Yeah. We had a. Not that I remember. Ah. <laughs> it wasn't the same without you. <laughs> it was exactly the same. <laughs> Just less Sunshine Tuna. I didn't have to read the newspapers. Oh, that's true. There's, You know what? There's no point in reading it because she just oh. chats and goes, I'm from Canada. Oh. <laughs> Paul, welcome back. What's up? Hey, Paul. How's it going? <laughs> I always try to, I always, there's always things throughout the week I mean to send to Paul that I always forget. Uh, like little variations I'm looking at uh, or, yeah. like he's got so much uh, mm -hmm. information in that brain that I need from time to time. <laughs> my collection is all in totes in my garage and attic. I will look through them this weekend and see if I can find them. Dude, you have your collection like in the heat? Maybe he knows where it's not hot. Maybe I don't want these. <laughs> I don't want these like. We already have a bag of funky, swerves. funky, <laughs> questionable heat warped pez. You're gonna make him feel bad about it now. Yeah, you gotta dig that stuff out of the places where it's hot, man. That way it saves her. Oh, Allison and Grampster the hamster it's checking just, in. It's just this hamster guy. I, I know it. I'll never forget it. <laughs> As we <laughs> talked about earlier. <laughs> we'll never forget. Uh. <laughs> Sid has a surprise for the Michigan attendees. He's going to come in and be like, surprise! Oh, the surprise is that? him. He's yeah. the surprise. Is that like a bug that just flew by? I don't know. Did you see it? No. <laughs> Hold on. What the heck? <laughs> You feel okay? What the heck? You need to go lay down. So I called the I had to call the bug uh, people. So I stopped spraying for mosquitoes at my house. Oh gosh. And now the mosquitoes are they've they've organized themselves into military units and sieged my backyard. So uh I only ever see them land on you. <laughs> I mean I'm the general. I'm gonna take out the leader, the resistance. So I had to call and and have uh have the bug people come back and then i also noticed they have a wasp spray is it safe i don't know i mean not for wasps <laughs> i thought you like to use the salt gun i do i do i do like to use the salt gun but um the wasps like our uh furniture so like the chairs they go up in the little holes so you're sitting out there and all of a sudden the wasp is like i need to come and fly underneath you <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nasty mud wasps, dirt daughters, whatever the heck they're called. Yeah. 
I'm in line yeah. to pick up my birthday cake. What? Tuna, Wait, that is, is dedication. Today your birthday cake? That is dedication. I mean, is that your birthday? <laughs> well, today's definitely the birthday cake. <laughs> oh. Happy birthday. If it's, if it's your birthday. If it's not, happy birthday anyway. Let's <laughs> see. She says she has a million errands to do last week. Mm-hmm. Uh. I mean, mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. You made Greg cry. OMG! When my daughters were room hopping late at night, I was worried. But when Bob and I went, we discovered how much fun it was and how safe it was. Oh. Yeah, it was. I'll tell you, the, the, uh, the St. Louis convention was really in the perfect location, too. Like, at least for me. Or the last few years of it. Yeah. John could tell you how many, but... Because it was closer to us. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's a nice, it was it's a nice, a nice area. area. Had good parking. Like, it was, uh, it's a, it was a good spot. Oh, man. So we had a pretty exciting week for Pez, didn't we? Because we, yeah. we bought some things online, probably bought some stuff that oh. was too expensive. Yeah. And it uh, came really fast. It came, yeah, it came really fast. And then I bought some stuff from. Uh, I, I bought I bought a few things that I probably shouldn't have, but. Uh, I don't know what it is. Did it come? <laughs> yeah. The good news is, is the pool leak that I thought I was going to have to spend thousands uh. of dollars on seems like it's fixed for. Yeah. I don't think the water went down at all last night. Mm-hmm. Not 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 enough to care. No. Because we had the heater on, so it's gonna be it's gonna steam off a Did little you bit. Turn that off. I didn't turn it off. <laughs> Did you turn it off? No. That thing costs like twenty dollars an hour to run. And I need to go turn it off soon. <laughs> I don't Jeez. think I did. I meant to do it this morning. <sighs> the uh, and then met up with David Welch, and bought some stuff from him. Which we'll show you. I mean, this not not this. I mean, I, I did get this dirty whistle from him, but um, you know, this is not one I intentionally. Um, intentionally bought. So he's got some. He's he's looking for coaches for me. That's not, a, that's not a really rare one. No. No, it's actually like the most common one. The dirt spot on the side, it and it's a little, more. it's a little sun damage too. So he dug, <laughs> basically just dug through his stuff and found any whistles he had and That's brought nice. them show. Yeah, it was real nice. It was real nice. I gotta do that. Uh, I gotta try to do that at with some other people's collections too. See if I can scare up some whistles. <laughs> uh, we got my desk moved out of here. Oh uh, yeah. It's unbelievable. Um, into the other room. So much room. Yeah, so much room. I can walk behind the desk here. Yeah, so my uh, <laughs> studio is coming along. We we will probably do stuff in there from time to time, I would think. We could. Because we could it will set up have, the live stream in there. Yeah, yeah, we could set we could do the live stream in there. Because I'm going to set it up as... Um, it's going to have probably two or three different uh, sets in it. Mm. So stuff for my actual day job uh, where I make technical videos for my work um and uh yeah just other things so the desk is out Erin is all alone in here i don't know what she's going to do with all this space a dance over there that's where i make my dancing tiktok because she certainly didn't move her desk to give me any more space over here so <laughs> no i have to figure it out because uh i don't want to just move it and then i'll mess up my little area here so yeah that's my next thing i was gonna clean the carpet because greg spilled coffee over on his side of the carpet and apparently he did not clean it up as well as i thought because once we moved the desk you could see it i mean the desk was (laughs) over it what do i care no i'm kidding i honestly didn't know i didn't Um, know it was down there either it's dark over there and there's like super shag carpet in here which makes it great for a studio but really terrible for spilling coffee yeah the carpet was like brand new too. We bought the house. Yeah, yeah. That's got to be. I think it'll come out with the carpet cleaner. Or the, we have a giant like carpet thing you get to drive around. So push around. It works really well. Yeah, she she needs the space honestly because it wouldn't be wouldn't be too difficult to actually set up another set in here. 
like whether for doing product shots or or whatever i already um, have used the new space oh yeah because i can walk behind here and get to the camera i can get to the power strip I sh if you watch my barky brown video you'll see a new angle or i shot like straight back here so i put the um little turntable here like right in front of me and i shot straight back so that was a fun that was a fun one and uh, also I can get to like the camera over here where I do the B-roll yeah. and where we use the, <laughs> where we use on our live stream here for the turntable. Plus I have like a little staging table over there I can use. Yeah, she continuously put her crap on my desk, which irritated me to no <laughs> end. Like, like everything video related would like pile up on my desk. Yeah. Now I just and put I would, like the extra lenses and camera. I'd have like a little square there. to move my mouse. I'm like, <laughs> so... getting there i'm gonna fi i'll figure out something cool to do paul mud mud daubers are territorial and mean man like what makes them good oh it's not i mean they're like trying to I infest mind, my my patio furniture i don't mind if they're yeah i don't mind if they're outside it's when they're like flying right by you because they're they live in the chairs like they make their little houses in the inside of our chairs and then when you sit in them, then they're like, oh, we need to come out and get some mud or whatever they do. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, the annual national oh, Pez convention. It's not the St. Louis Pez convention, probably. The annual national <laughs> Pez convention. <laughs> I always laugh at that name. Sorry, uh, John, but it's funny. Uh, was at the Marriott in town and country for 12 years. Oh, yeah. 12 years. Wow. It's like... We haven't even opened boxes yet, so this is not going to be good. <laughs> I vacuumed and dusted and cleaned the desk everything for you. I even vacuumed some of these black uh, sound panels that we have hanging up. Because I was like, well, now I can get back here even better. So I vacuumed like those three again. Hmm. Just for you, Gray. Just for you. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what we're going to do with these sound panels. Like I was thinking maybe, um, depending on what kind of set, like maybe take down the panels and put up put up uh, drapes or something that might look nicer oh. for if you're gonna shoot like yeah. into them or maybe get you get yourself a green screen or something to let you can lift up in front of them oh. you know something like that yeah because I mean, the... they don't look bad they just sometimes i feel like painting the walls black but i don't know <laughs> paint them black i don't care what you do it's your office now or your studio now you've inhabited two rooms in this house oh it says the person with two rooms, too. <laughs> I only had one. You forced me to have two. <laughs> Threw me out. I took all my stuff and put it on the lawn. Well, now you can work up here sometimes, too. My office, by the way, is sweet downstairs. <laughs> like, I have a huge bay window. Like, I have a bathroom. Like, it, it is awesome. And she wants me to come up here into, like, a bedroom <laughs> just so that she can see me during the day. So. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. So great. <sighs> I don't know. I don't see anybody commenting like that's a good. That's a good idea, Aaron. I know like, they're not getting in the middle of that. <laughs> not crazy. Thanks, Chubby. Appreciate it. Oh, okay. so anybody buy the new Pez that was just released yesterday? The hamburger. It's like a. Man, I could eat a hamburger. Like, go to pez.com there. Oh, no. Really? Yeah, can you not? You know my. Look at all these tabs. <laughs> can I close this yeah, whole just thing? Close it. I mean, who knows you what I'll share? You can use Safari. Oh. I never used that. Piz.com. Piz.com. Does Piz right. ever have any commercials? Yet? There. No. Right there, that first one. Okay, let me share it. Wait, which one? This one? Yeah. Okay. So who... Hold on, hold on. Let me share it. Who bought this? It. Let, me sh let me share it. Okay, let's see if I can do this without sharing our whole desktop.
current application safari Ooh, look at that it's funny because you have to click it which shares the screen instantly and then you have to click it again so you have to be careful not to make sure there's anything like personal on your desktop <laughs> uh, so who bought the grill in chill pez treats exclusive burger i don't know that thing is really sweet actually I think I talked about this last week, but I like the fact that they actually spent some effort, like, crafting it. Yeah, the card is cute. <laughs> well, it's also called Pez Treats. That's the Pez Treats line. So there's, like, you know, the hamburger, the taco, the pizza. Man, they should have had a new type of candy, though. Meat. A hamburger? No. <laughs> What? Uh, you don't think that's a good idea? Maybe. <laughs> Barbecued meat. That's right. Ketchup. Mustard. <laughs> Grill then chill on it. You know, ketchup candy probably sell pretty well in Canada. They like everything with ketchup. They like the ketchup chips. We got some from Sunshine Tuna. That's right. Hey, what else? That's new. That's it. That's it? <laughs> so yeah, all so this... It, who bought one? Did anyone buy one? I bought one. You did buy one? Yeah. I had to. It's cute. We're back. I like the treats. <laughs> I'm a sucker for uh, the stem, but like still it's not. I think they could have done better with the burger Ooh, pun. Almost sneezed again. Okay, come on, oh, Greg. Oh, yeah. yeah. Come on, Greg. My fault. <laughs> I mean... You know, you claim you dusted. I didn't take my Zyrtec today. That's the problem. Uh, we were outside a lot. We were outside a lot. Why don't you go take some? I'm not getting out of here. You have to go get it. You have to get the cockatoos anyway. Oh. Uh. Mm. I just heard Mark fire up his Corvette. All right. Let's see. I'm getting some wasp knowledge here. Wasp eat bald-faced hornets whatever they are well what happens when there's only <laughs> hornets beards there's plenty of wasps outside it's just the two or three that keep living out of furniture yeah i'm not going to eradicate all wasps on earth no Paul. don't worry just the couple on our furniture I, I would think if we were to plug those holes they would probably move on wouldn't they Probably. I just don't like the idea of like plugging the holes if they're in there. It creeps me out. <laughs> it's sad. It's like it's the same as the existing burger stem, same stem, etc. Just a yeah. new card, right? It's the grilling. It's the different. It's the same Pez. It's the same stem. It just has the different saying and the different card. Yeah, yeah. But I at least like the burger, like and the, the popcorn. One is really cute. Yeah, the popcorn when they're coming out. Yeah. With. I think they need an avocado. Oh, here we go. I saw yesterday an ad with tomato sauce on ice cream. What? What? That is gross. That sounds like something that might like be weirdly good. No. Like, you know, like it sounds horrible. You know, sometimes things sound no. horrible. No. But are like weirdly good. No. I'm going to say no. I wouldn't try that. Well, you don't like tomato sauce. Tomato sauce isn't like me. I don't know. <laughs> Tomato sauce is kind of a jerk. <laughs> Did you get the ghost spider pez yet? Yes, it's in a box over there. <laughs> it is? I guess I could open it. I was going to save it and make a video on it. You were going to open box it on a video? Yeah. Or show it with some other stuff because reasons? Because the movie came out this weekend. Oh, did it? Yes. Well, that should already be, that should come out Tuesday then. Yes, maybe. That's a good idea. Yeah. Full of them. It just came. I got a. What did I even get? Uh, the ghost spider. Oh, there's something else in there. You have to wait. Ah. <laughs> I ah. could open it. I could open it. I they think. might be solitary bees. There are tons of different types of them. Now they're definitely mud daubers. I looked it up. We'll send you a video. Yeah. You'll see me. You'll they see come me really ass close. assault them with a. Uh, I have a salt weapon. That shoots salt, and I roll. Greg, I, aren't you getting the hint? He doesn't want you to murder 
the wasps. No, what happens is <laughs> I put on like the the face mask like a Navy SEAL, like the little thing under my cheeks, so the sun doesn't sh reflect off and tea, you know, tip off the wasps that I'm coming for it. And then I load up with salt. And then I essentially dive out of the back door. I roll. I come up to the the patio furniture and pow! Greg one, wasp zero. Mm. And that's, that's how it's done, essentially. Right? Yeah. See? <laughs> Witnesses. I want to say no, but yes. <laughs> oh, we have so much wildlife. There's a baby deer that keeps popping into our... I don't know how it squeezes through the fence because our fence is like so like tiny little slats but this like little baby deer keeps popping in and running around yeah the tree the tree people were here Friday yesterday, yesterday yeah and uh, when they op when they came in it ran past it them busted through the fence I was there yeah they had to like run around our yard trying to scoop it up to That's get it so to cute. they didn't touch it they just Herded it out. Yeah. We got frogs. So many frogs. Our neighbors have like a pond in their backyard and it's so loud outside at night. I don't know how they can the deal with goes it. Down. I don't know. Yeah. Allison says, we're building two armies, a Star Wars and a Superheroes. Nice. Yeah, that that's cool. I could, I could totally see myself having a Superheroes army. We have a lot. Yeah. But not enough for an army. No. No. <laughs> I don't have an army. I guess pandas. But I don't plan on like just buying all the pandas in the world. I could. Maybe because they're harder to get. Nice. You know turtles can climb fences? Have you ever seen a turtle climb a fence? Oh yeah. Like the box turtles. Yeah. They're they're crazy climbers. Like I don't understand how it happens. I mean, it's slow, but they do it. Yeah. Paul says, salt on the garden kills plants. He just doesn't... Oh. But see, what he doesn't realize is it's one shot, one kill. Like, so there's no no extra salt. <laughs> now he's just messing with you, Paul. <laughs> you know, what, what uh. you miss is me running and screaming in the backyard while wasps I'll take a are, video. are trying to follow me. Like, like, not even hitting the wasp. Not even hitting the wasp. I'm peppering the earth in salt. And that's why our trees die. Probably. <laughs> Probably. Oh, man. I don't think it's enough salt to kill them. No. No. It's a tiny bit. It's a tiny, tiny bit. Oh, man. Let's talk about pets. Why don't you go get those cockatoos and get me a Zyrtec? Yes, sir. Please. <laughs> that would be very sweet of you. If uh, Aaron ever... If ever... If Aaron ever starts a Patreon, maybe we'll have a... Uh, we'll have a... Um, a series called The Greg... Verse wasp escapades. I mean, last year I was up in the twenties with the wasps. I mean, they just are relentless. They just, they just never, never quit. Just collecting Star Wars makes an army. I think I have about forty, all different ones. Yeah, it's really fun. Like people make a lot of fun of Star Wars uh, collecting because people list them on ebay is vintage and rare and all that stuff but there are very fun variations and and they're very fun to collect i need to go through ours and see what we have and what we don't have i haven't circled around yet to uh to figure that out we did get something big only only sid knows about it but we did get something big in the mail dang you all right yeah here you know, if you have to go to the hospital, we're going to live stream the whole thing. Hey, I'm tough. <laughs> <laughs> that would be an adventure. Thank you for that. I appreciate it. You're welcome. I don't know if I can make it another hour and a half or however long we have without it. <laughs> Are you ready to need to step out of the room? <laughs> I might have to. Just uh, to see how it goes. <coughs> collecting a... 
army of Star Wars. <laughs> death to the planet. Oh, I love the planet. There's no death to the planet. Just, just I'm just very territorial. It's like two wasps, three wasps. Well, last year I was up. I don't know how what number I got up to, but it was up there. You would think that they wouldn't come back, but somehow they find the same little holes. I know. They're relentless is what I was saying. All right. So saying that we also got something in the mail that was big. Unfortunately, we had some shipping damage that we're going to have to deal with. Uh, so we can't quite uh, release it just yet. But very soon you'll see something on the channel that I think is uh, going to blow your mind. It's cool. It's very cool. It's very cool. I only I sent the picture to Sid just to get him stoked up for today. Just now? No, yesterday I was oh. talking to him. Secrets. Well, he has a box of stuff. I want to see what's inside of it, mm. so I have to be nice. Wait, did you open your boxes, Sid? Or is it just a stack still? We'll just wait until he answers. We're going to send Sid a link to join the live stream so you can open your boxes. <laughs> Oh, yeah, we can definitely do that. We can definitely have people come on the live stream and show stuff. Hang on one second. No, I just don't want to gross everyone out. Yeah. <laughs> just me. <laughs> that's that's the least of your problems. Oh. Yeah, Sid's so sworn to silence. Oh. Um, well, jo John knows, but... Only because he's involved with our shenanigans. <laughs> he's part of the part of the group. The shenanigans. Part of the Piz crew. I think we should save these for a few minutes because they're really cool. No, no, we're not gonna save them for a few minutes. No. What time? What time is this? Forty-two in. This I is when we know. start opening. Uh, give us a thumbs up on this video if you want to see it. what's in this box. What's in the box? What's in, what's the, in the box? box? <laughs> he says in process. We'll post after this. Sid says, "Here, let me uh, let me start with the with the with these." Okay, so um, got this no foot whistle, just a Hong Kong guy. These things are worth like ten or fifteen bucks at the most. So um, I'm trying to get them though. So if you have them and you want to sell them, they're the Hong Kong ones, and they're in that range, the ten or fifteen dollar range. Uh, hit me up and I'll buy them all. I could put it on the spinner. I will. And then this is a oh, thin foot. It doesn't stand up. Wait. This is a thin foot whistle. And I honestly didn't know that these were thin, that there were thin foot Hong Kong 3.9 whistles. So, um, you know, three to five bucks for this guy. Thin foot with feet. Two bucks, one buck, something like that. D depends. Depends if you have sets and things like that. But um, these are really fun to collect because th the loop color determines the color of the whistle. So, like, this same whistle will exist, but it'll have the yellow loop, see, instead of the orange loop. So there's a pair, there's a set of these, and there'll be a set of them with this stem color, and there, I think there's even sets of them with other stem colors, but the same top. Put that over there. I was going to show just that one first. Oh, just that because, one first? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh. We can do that. Because it's beautiful. Why is it so dark? I don't know. Did you not set the ISO? I mean, it shouldn't change, but yes. Brighten that baby up. So if you look at this whistle, it's considered red head green stem because the little loop is, is it better? yeah, that's way better. Uh, better. Yeah, I think that's probably good okay. because the uh, loop is red. Are you going to give Do it a little spin? One? I don't know if I have this one, to be honest. I haven't looked. Um, right now, I'm just kind of buying every whistle that I see, and then I'll figure out what I have because they're not really not really worth that much so it's easier for me just to just buy them all and then sort them out and i can sell the duplicates are you like the guy on ted lasso instead of blowing the whistle he's like whistle yeah exactly whistle <laughs> all right back back to us 
Sid says his first box was shampoo and deodorant. Oh. Well, we don't open all of our boxes. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Like, we should have a game, Pez or no Pez, when we open boxes. I don't know if I want people knowing what I buy. Oh, that's probably true. Or what you buy. You're the one that buys most of the stuff. <laughs> Look at, uh... Woo! So these are Thin Feet 3.9. And uh, the white one has got some sun fade to it. So, and it's dirty. Check out that super rare dirty spot on the star. Oh, yeah. It that's makes it more valuable, like $10 more. Marbled. Uh -uh. <laughs> Marbled with black dirt. Beautiful. But these, the red, white, and blue whistles have to be the most common one. Like, that's all I ever see is red, white, and blue whistles. They're everywhere. Just screams America. Yeah, it does, but I like it. I like it. That'd be a good uh, 4th of July Pez to carry you around. I don't usually carry around Pez on holidays, but I guess I could. Yeah, okay, you can. Should. Yeah. Should we show them some of these? Mm-hmm. Start with blue there. This is my favorite one. <laughs> yeah, so... It's blue. What I wanted to try to do is try to... Try to get some... Different variations of, of Pez. And the the cows are just too expensive. Oh. So I was thinking about getting cows. But the cockatoos are ones that are uh, affordable. So, so most of these are in the $60 range. 60 65 70 something like that. And um, do you want to put it up here? Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to do them individually. This one gets its own spin. Okay, okay. This is my favorite. All right. Wait. Uh, is it focused? No. Negatory. Come on, you can do it. Come on. There, there we go. <laughs> I mean, look how nice that looks. That's a good look looking at, one. Look in the light, like the head looks a lot lighter blue than mm -hmm. the stem even. Mm -hmm. But it is pretty close. Yeah. Okay, that's enough of that. What? People might be all into this at home. Like... No, they're going to see it again here in a second when we put these other ones up there. <laughs> oh, should I keep it up? Yeah, just keep it... Uh... Okay, well, now we'll just rapid fire then. Okay. So if you don't know what a cockatoo pez is, if you're new here... Not everybody knows. Okay, tell These them. are cockatoo pez. And uh, we have a whole box of them. Because Greg likes them. <laughs> no, I like variations. And I like them. <laughs> and they're cute. I like these a lot. We do have a couple sitting behind you there. Behind yeah. your head. Yeah, that's what I was going to... Maybe gonna... should I put them like that, maybe? Yeah, you can. That way we don't have to spin it. Oh, wait. This is cool. Look at that pink sleeve. Yeah, show that. This has got a pink sleeve. Really nice. It's a fun one. This one has the same head as the first one I showed you. Does uh does anybody have any other cockatoos? Like, do you like cockatoos? Is it something that you collect? This one has a yellow sleeve. Yeah. Is that all the? Nope. Oh. I'll say you can show the blue ones. Oh. Good thinking. Oh, this one. Oh, I like this one a lot too. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Red, red, red. And then the head. They all, they, like they have the pink button in there too. Mm hmm That's a good one. This might be my f second fave. Your second fave? Okay, we'll show these first because these are the blue head ones. Ooh, it's, cockatoo. It's a little crooked. I tried. This one's this one here in the middle <laughs> is blind. Oh wait, what? No. It's fine. He can still see. He's missing his paint. This, he has a big beak. Maybe he can sniff better. It's like Daredevil. Yeah, he's just to learn his other senses. Is the beak the nose? Is there they sniff from the beak? I'm not sure. I don't know. I, mean, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm not not up on my cockatoo anatomy. <laughs> yeah, so I think these are pretty fun variations and colors. They're all kind of like um Yeah, Sid says I have too many cockatoos because I keep trying to find them without wonky uh, eyes. Yeah, good luck with that. The wonky? The wonky eyes is what makes them cute, though. Oh, it gives them personality. Yeah, because they're hand-painted, so... This one looks pretty good. 
What are the ones we have back here? This one looks pretty good. Oh yeah, those are greenhead ones, so those will be good to... Oh. That one's missing... Oh, this one's missing two eyes. Yeah. Oh, this one has no... Con this one has no patent number on it. I think they all... This they one? all have... They're all missing patents. This one has... Wait. Or most of them are. No, that has... Yeah, I think the middle one is missing both eyes. Either rubbed off, played off, whatever. Yeah, this one, that that one is the only one missing the eyes so far. Just get the little sharpie out. <laughs> no one will ever know, Gary. This one has a patent in a country. Hmm. Dirt daubers are not dangerous like a wasp. No, but they sting and they're territorial. Mm. And when they come near Aaron, she screams bloody murder, and I have to do something about it. <laughs> oh, it just seems like we have. It used to be just like one chair, and then this summer it seems like it's like Every chair. all chairs. Yeah. Yeah. Ever since we stopped that mosquito spray. <laughs> oh, gnats, too. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. The gnats are really bad, too. <laughs> This uh, this one has an all that this this is nice. Look at that yellow with the yellow. Oh yeah, that's nice. Are you having a con a pers a private conversation? This one uh, this one look at that. It's like uh, this one has like a really really. I don't know, what color is that. Is that a light yellow? I don't think it's off. I think it's light yellow, but this pusher in that one's just white. This one's really cool too. I like the green and the red. That's the Christmas cockatoo. Get those two behind me if you if you can. Put those yes, on there. Sir. Well, people can see the cockatoo variations of the green head. Oh my gosh, there's so many. Okay, wait. I flipped it to this camera so they could see. Oh, thank you. Oh, you had three back there? Four back there? Four. Oh. Because lately, you, just recently, you got like these two. Recently, you just got these two green head ones. Yeah. So, you know, it's hard to know which, which combinations are legit versus not legit because the parts are so easy to swap around. Oh, yeah. But, um, uh, Essentially, what I think is is the. It's really the colors that make the big difference. Like mm -hmm. the red heads are more valuable, and then if you have anything peach. Um, anything peach raises the value of them. So, I, I think that's probably more, the more important part. I don't think anyone will ever know, which, combinations because. You know these things are just put together randomly. Yeah. And, and, Does it uh, really matter, I guess? Yeah, I don't think. This, uh, we don't have any yellow. So put that other green one up there so people can see because it's a green one. Oh, oh, wait. Duh. Duh. It doesn't fit. This, I didn't put this one up because I was looking at the beak. This one has the orange beak. This isn't, we got this one at that auction. Yeah. That. Sid says one of ours is lighter green. What's that? That one you just put behind the other one, I think. That one. This one looks a little light. It does. Yeah, I, I don't know if that's a true variation. It's probably just uh, a different year, if I were to guess. I mean, it might be a true variation, but only because maybe it, maybe it was uh, a year after or something. <laughs> I know, like, what are you even doing there? <laughs> Here. I'm trying to get a good view of it, because... Oh, there we go. Is that better? Yeah. I have the giant hairs. It does look a little lighter. Yeah, it does look a little lighter, but, you know, like, who knows? They made these things for years. So I think you're going to see ver variations in yeah. the greens. And then there's... And then there's the yellow. And then there's yellow. Ooh, look at that. Which I always do like the yellow. And then there's ones we don't have. We don't have any red ones. 
So there are red ones too. Wait, that we don't have. Oh, we don't. Mm -mm. Wait, look how big that eye. The eyes on this thing. Wait, yeah. the eyes on this one are like gigantic. <laughs> Whoever was painting them was was really doing their job. Oh, it looks so cute. Maybe that's why I like that one a lot. It looks happy. Let's see what Sid says. I need a red one, but heard those were made in a tree house in Australia uh. and <laughs> in Austria and aren't legit. Yeah, I mean, who knows? The stuff from that tree house is sus, is sus for sure. Yeah. I know what you're talking about. If you watch the Pez out well, you'll know what he's talking about. The key is, is we got to find them in the cello, but even then it's not, even then it's, you know, you can put them in cello. Mm -hmm. So still not guaranteed, but if you find them in cello, at least, at least it's a uh, better chance that it's real. Look at that. What a great start to our unboxing. I think it is a great start. <laughs> that looks familiar, doesn't it? What is the countdown? countdown. What is that? That's just somebody else going live on uh, Facebook. The stream yard one or whatever. Should we open some more? Yeah, let's open some more. We're at 56 minutes Where's... in. Oh, shoot. Oh, don't curse on here. I said shoot. I don't curse, guys. Mm. Okay. What do you think's in here? I have no idea. Is this eBay? No clue. So, could be? All I can say is that the stuff I bought was way, 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 way too expensive this, this week. That way we have... That's why we have fewer boxes. It was a budget buster. But I felt pretty happy about the pool. <laughs> the clover was doing better, so. Oh. Oh yeah. I'm excited for it? this. Yeah, sure. So I saw these, somebody making these on, someone made this and posted it on. These are pretty cool. eBay. And, uh, you know, I collect skulls, all sorts of skulls, fantasy skulls. Just keep talking. <laughs> are we ready? Huh? Yes. Okay. These are really neat. Like way cooler than I thought they were gonna be. So these people, this whoever made I don't know who these who this people. who this is or if it's a person or whatever, but um <laughs> hopefully it's a person, not an alien. Could be a machine, makes them, I don't know. Person presses the button. It looks like that. But thing I think it's handmade. Like, I, I think, think they're dipped. I think they dip them. Oh, are you are you dipped? Yeah, he says he's dipped. Uh -huh. Yeah. That's really cool. Super cool. Here, put him over there. So I got. I think I think I got more than. Did I only get those two? Elmo's, yeah, you tried to bid on uh, Batman. Somebody oh yeah, somebody outbid me on Batman. Me. I paid twenty bucks for these. I was not gonna pay more than that for a one dollar skull. There you go. The red one is amazing. Yeah, the red one. The red one is super cool. The blue one's really cool, though. I like them both. Oh, look at that. They look cooler in real life. That is the coolest. Are they in focus? <laughs> focus enough. Yeah. This is where you I am so happy the, with this purchase. The sound effects. Like, it has, like, little love heart sound effects. Yeah. I am super, super happy. If you like these, hit the thumbs up. Unless you hit it before, then don't hit it again. <laughs> yeah, this is super cool. I'm I'm happy. I'm happy with those. I am shocked at how cool they look in real life. Yeah, they're neat. I will add this to my fantasy skull collection. Aaron is supposed to get me other fantasy skulls, but I don't know. What? Yeah, you know the pe the person who painted uh, those pandas was supposed to. Why don't you to... follow up with them? I don't know. Maybe he forgot. 
He's busy painting other people's fantasy pens. I don't know. I know. <laughs> I know. So those, those, uh, um, pandas right there, I'm supposed to get skulls that are the same. And we talked about, about cool colors and different things, right? Yeah. So he's probably working on them. Yeah. <laughs> That's right, Sid. That's right. What? Uh. <laughs> Pretty excited. Sid's gonna go to Michigan. I can now. I can now. I can harass him in real life. Oh. <laughs> him and Tuna. Wait, is Tuna going to Michigan? I thought she wasn't. Uh, what do you mean? That's where we got the yeah. But I think she wasn't chips. going this year. Oh, that's a bummer. Did not see those. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. <laughs> they had Batman ones that were also yeah. very cool. And I do have a little Batman fantasy collection going on. So I, I almost went overboard. Um, can you hand me my knife there? I almost went overboard to get them because I really do want to start... Um, I do really want to start uh, getting some more fantasy Batman stuff. Just said he's not going. I thought he just said he had a. He was going. He had a. Uh, he says I'm not going to Michigan. I thought you were. You just said you had a um, uh, a surprise for everybody going to Michigan. So I just assumed that meant you were going to be there to give out the uh -huh. surprise. Well, that bums me out. <laughs> So you to, can still register. I just have to make Jim Blaine entertain me. When I'm not shooting. <laughs> still register. You can still <laughs> register. Ugh. This is how you ship Pez, by the way. That's why I let you open that one. Hello. 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 You know you want to do it. It's okay, you can. I'll do it later. <laughs> he has a surprise for attendees, but he doesn't know who's going to be attending because he won't be there. Oh, I don't know. What is this? I think I might have bought this by accident. Mm, I like it, though. You can't really, it's hard to see, but this is a pink faced goofy. He's pretty pink. And then. The way I put it on the spinner? Yeah. That's what it's for. Kind of smelly. And then, um, I, of course, Pluto's, when I can get him. It looks pretty good, though. And his eyes, Pluto's eyes are really good on this one. So, I like this one. This is an Austria. Uh, three four Pluto and I don't think we have tons of these where the eyes are in really good shape like this Probably not it seems like the Pluto eyes are all these all the eyes on these vintage pets. I know if you get good-looking eyes, then it's a good Pez like you're lucky I don't like how Goofy's looking at me. <laughs> That's what he gets. Great, that was not very nice. <laughs> That's it. No more spinning. If you want to see this spin, you can comment and I'll spin it again. But otherwise, moving on. <laughs> Who is going to Pesamania, Ohio? So we're we're going for sure. The um <laughs> the question is is like the hotel is not uh. dog friendly. So, um, a little sad about that. So we might get like an Airbnb or something. Didn't we already get a hotel? We, we, no, I paid for the hotel just to, just to block uh, it for us, but it's not dog friendly. Uh, no, we didn't get that hotel. We got the one across the street or something. It's not, we didn't, we're not. I know, but it's still not dog friendly. Uh, yeah. We didn't register for the hotel. Yeah.
Nice. We're all going to be in Pezzamania. Oh, That'd Carol. be fun. We finally meet Carol. Yeah. Just look for me running around with the camera after air and you'll know it's us. I am. Oh, Chubby Chucker's going too. Oh, that's good. At first I thought he says, I'm also Carol. <laughs> I'm, all, I'm also hey, Allison. I'm also Allison. <laughs> I'd be like, well. Hey. <laughs> all right. Oh, I had to read that a couple times. <laughs> Trying to open this box. It takes complete concentration. Yeah, Pe Pezzamania is going to be great. But like I said, I might I might rent a house so that we can bring Clover. The only problem is I don't know if they'll let us bring Clover inside uh -huh. the, the hotel to room hop. Or we could just do it. I've seen people bring their... Oh, yeah. This, I know what this is. What is this? I know what this is. So so this I bought this from a person on Facebook. Oh. And... Uh, what? <laughs> Chubby's what like... Is, wait, okay, what is... Tell me what that is. Yeah, so... Okay, so some people might say this is some damage or it's just... Um, just uh, the plastic getting old, but um, I see a lot of people with these like teal front Captain Americas, and we don't have one. So we have black helmet, we have blue helmet, but we don't have a teal one. So I wanted a teal one. However, that got teal. I don't know, but. Uh, But I wanted it. But it's teal. Yeah. Wait, let's show them this one. Uh, I look at, let me look I at can't that. wait any longer, Granny. This is a he's a this is a dirty dude. This might be my new favorite. Dirty, ones. dirty dude. That's why I didn't tell you about this one. I don't think that's correct, by the way. Why? I don't think it came on that side. I'll still like it. I don't care. Alright, guys. Oh. oh, messed up the reveal. <laughs> Soft head, Wonder Woman, USA, lavender stem. It's so pretty. This is a great looking dispenser. I don't know if it's correct though. She actually looks good too. Like sometimes. So I bought this one because. Is that USA two? I think. It's USA two, but they're all U. They're all oh, USA. Yeah, because it's soft head. And, but and her makeup is different than the one yeah, we have. Yeah, it looks good. I know that's what I was gonna say. Like these, these look really nice. So one fun thing, if you're a variation collector, is in the soft heads. Look at this. Look at the difference in the heads. Pretty cool, right? Yeah. You like these? Super story? cool, cause yeah. she's a superhero, Gray. No, she's a princess. She's a demigod. She's royalty. I uh, I like these a lot. Yeah. Like I said, this week I bought too many expensive things, and this is one of them. How much? Oh, will you tell me later. Yeah, I'll tell you later. But uh, in my TikTok that went viral, has like over a million views, and my I say my favorite Pez, and I show the soft head Wonder Woman, and everyone's like, "Why is that your favorite?" Pez? <laughs> like, I know she's so, it's like so cool. Yeah. I like the soft head pens and I think the and I'm a Wonder Woman fan, so when I made that video like a little over a year ago now, it was probably my favorite pens at the time. <laughs> I think it's super cool. I like that uh purple one a lot. This red one looks nice too. Yeah. So it's so you can't just assume that, that it's only the penguin that comes on the violet, by the way, because um there are lots of other stems that that showed up on these in oh. cellos. This one says Hong Kong, DC Comics. So there's variations on these two? Does that one say that? I can't read it. Oh yeah, now that it's sitting there I can't read it. <laughs> this one uh This says at DC Comics nineteen seventy seventy six or seventy eight. DC Comics Inc. Mm. What does that one say? 
Hong Kong DC Comics. Just that. Wait. Yeah. You read that. It is different. So there's some that just there's some that say Hong Kong DC Comics, and there's other ones that say DC Comics. Maybe? Yeah. So this one says oh, Hong says, Kong. And that one does not. Oh, I see the 1978. It says this is DC Comics Inc. Yeah. This one does not have a date. So I don't know which one's worth more. I'm sure somebody in the chat will. But um, so there's no specific Erie Specter stem like it's all the usa lavenders are all exactly the same it's just the soft heads don't mount on the little mechanism properly they're like glued by a human so see it's got this like plastic block that the soft <laughs> that they glue the soft heads on they're like doll heads right? yeah so that's why it looks like it's a different height because they you know glued by some person that doesn't care so um. Yeah, you don't know, like, yeah, it could have been. Yeah, we have a bunch of, I mean, we're starting to accumulate a bunch of lavender stem USA stuff. It could have been stuff, just but... taken off and put on there, too. I don't know how easy it would be to get that off. I don't know, it's super cool out. Yeah, I don't care. Don't question it. <laughs> yeah, so I have a Wonder Woman red stem made in the USA. Is it soft head, Collector Pez, or is it... Uh, the the regular head because we don't have the regular head made in the usa i don't know if they made it or not but there's lots of variations in the wonder woman pose which is really fun there's like ray star white face regular face uh different hair molds um and these have different paint jobs on yeah. them depending i guess who painted them in what year mm-hmm <laughs> You like that, don't you? Yes, yeah, cool. <laughs> I, that's why I purposely didn't tell you. I, when I saw her selling that, I had to have it. I overpaid for it, but I had to have it. Even if it's wrong. Which, it's not as certain that it is. I think you, I opened another soft head superhero last week that was on a different... Oh, the Joker. The Joker. Weeks ago? Wait, I think I took it down. Yeah, so... Um, finally took it down the glass but what I will tell you is is that lots of collectors that have bought the stuff brand new or from people who bought it brand new have different color USA stems so yeah. I don't believe that we can just say it didn't come on the different ones oh. with, with any certainty we can definitely say they're much more likely on the other stems mm -hmm. like they're much more common but I don't think that you can ever say it for sure never did. Unless it's just like a way off, like a two six like a two six stem on a on something that wasn't created until like the three four stem dates or something. Something like completely ridiculous. Yeah. Timothy says hello Aaron. Hey Timothy. Hey buddy, I'm I'm here too. I'm here too. Make Greg feel left out. I mean, come on. That's Greg. He might not know your name. Oh, I'm Greg. I'm Greg. Hello, Timothy. Welcome. Because people, I mean, they, if they watch my channel, they know me. I know. I'm just giving You're them, only on Saturday, Just Greg. giving them trouble. You're only on Saturday. This. I think this still has the plastic cover on it. Wait. What do you got there? Save that for later. It's a uh, gizmo. Oh, yeah. Bright lights. Don't feed him after midnight. He'll turn into a crazy wasp and live in your chair. That's right. <laughs> this is cool. This, I don't know, like this gizmo thing, the Pop Pez, is the Funko Pop Pez, is hard to get. Or people want crazy, put it on there. People want crazy amounts for it. And I'm like, no. Look at it. It's cute. <laughs> doesn't look as cute as the gremlin on the show, but it's nah. cute. I switched. I'm, I'm eyeing it up. So, so they're not looking at just someone, nothing. Uh, put this, someone had this on eBay. No one was bidding on it. I think I bought it for like 
10 or 15 dollars i think i want to say which was a good price because usually they're like way more than that sid says the zyrtec woke me up uh it did help my nose that's for yeah, sure yeah you haven't sneezed or weird no nose noises over here <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but i've been sassy since about 8 a.m today so <laughs> I woke up like this, Sid. You woke up at like 6.30. Okay. Oh, this is, you can open this one because it's from your B, your BFF, Kyle. I don't even think he's here. How can he be no. my BFF if he doesn't come to the that's live why, stream? That's why he's your BFF. Cause... Ridiculous. You're supposed to support your friends. <laughs> should, I, should, I, should you like send him a message and be like, jump on the live stream so I can talk about it? I was talking to him already today. We were talking crap about that green on green yappy uh, that, that sold. What did it go for? Two seventy seven, and it's not correct. Well, I mean, just like the Wonder Woman, people will pay for it. Well, yeah, people might pay for it, but I don't even I don't even think there's yappies that are supposed to be on two six stems. I think they weren't around until three four. Oh. So it could be a. Uh, it could be the only way it would be legit is if it was a, a cow bee, maybe. Yeah. I don't know. I, I mean, if it was, it was a cool color combination. If it went for under two hundred, I was gonna buy it, but um, not for two seventy seven. That's just absurd. This was really a present for you. That's why I bought it. Extra. That's why I paid extra. <laughs> Wild coyote. Okay. Nice. Don't ask me. No idea. <laughs> I don't remember buying that at all. This, wait. Maybe he just put it in the box. Could be. This, I was for a second there. I forgot this was Kyle. Maybe you bought it. Maybe. Here, why don't you show him that while you open that? No? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Yeah. 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 I do remember buying it now. Because oh. you didn't have it. Oh. And I think the didn't the one we have we questioned if it was on the right stem. They were um oh, I think that was a Roadrunner on a green stem. Are you sure I don't have this? I did have them in my office for a couple of weeks. Oh maybe. That's fine. I'll take it. Well, there's a lot of variations on these old Roadrunner and Wiley Coyote pose, so this is a nice one. It has like a that color that light green I don't blue. think that's sea foam that's a different color no, but it has like a light green blue yeah it's like got a green blue stem or sleeve oh you know why you bought this why it's a USA stem oh oh that's why that's why it's a uh... made in Spain there you go. It's our first Spain Pez. Nice. Dang, that's right. That's right. He uh, cool. he mentioned that he was gonna sell. You know he can't. You know he, he just can't collect everything. And I said we don't have any Pez here that was made in Spain. So he said here I have this. Do you want to buy it? Thanks. I do remember. That's cool. Oh, this, look at that. That's what you wanted. This is the pair to my other crystal whistle. Oh, cool. Yeah, honey, you do whatever you want. There you go. There we go. Look at spin. that. So tell us the story about why is this so hard to get. So. They didn't make many? They didn't make many, and the story is there's two colors, and there's 300 total made, so 150 of each color. So, um, these are pretty expensive. I paid 150 bucks for this, so I'm pretty sure that's what I paid for the other one too. I can't remember though, but uh, I needed this to go with the other one. That got an extra couple spins because it's amazing. Greg's been wanting this for a while. The colors on that's really nice. Yeah. 
Yeah, so on the Spain Pez, it the the stems are going to be always be funky colors and the sleeves are going to be funky colors and you know, they're they're going to be different. Oh. Um All right. Well. Found some box. Very fun. I think you sent me this because he knew he charged me too much. Pick and save. <laughs> like an that's, inside joke. Maybe that's just where he shops. Oh, okay. Yeah. Ready for some good stuff? I don't remember what I paid for the Spain Wiley Coyote. I think it was like a hundred bucks or something. Oh yeah, this one's not open. <laughs> no, I opened it because I uh, took the label off and it was kind of open and then part of the wrapping thing came out and I was like oh shoot like hopefully nothing got messed up but uh, so I opened it up okay oh so what is this this is Ultraman 2 there you go Ultraman 2 loose mini. Oh, yeah, wait, in case you're wondering, it's Ultraman 2. You can see the names. I thought it was really nice that person did that. I like it. Yeah, the way they oh, sold. Look. So I think that maybe the collector did that, like whoever they were selling these for. I don't think they were, I don't think there was a person. I mean, I don't think it was a post collector selling these, but maybe because this holds this. So the pest collector probably did this. They were like in a binder in the picture, you know? Yeah. Mm. It's a neat way to display it. Yeah, because... There you go. The little insert. And then it came with this. I don't even remember you buying this one. <laughs> this one. Man, too. This is cool. I like this. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> what I didn't realize until recently is I always thought that these were just like a piece of paper, but they're like a cardboard. Mm hmm. So, you, like, I always was like, you know, it'd be easy to recreate these and sell them. How do you know that you're actually getting the real deal? But uh, it would be. It's harder, harder than to think. Yeah. Cause like when you see them online, they just look like a, you know, like a piece of paper that they th that goes in the vending machine. You want to put that, put those, open them up and put them on the little thing. So while you're doing that, Timothy has a question. Oh. Uh, do you collect all that comes out, or do you make a selection? Cool. Huh? <laughs> all the be... new stuff. Yeah, you, we we try to get all the new stuff, right? Yeah. I try At least not one to buy of each. The, I try not to buy one of them, but. <laughs> Yeah. Um, no, I usually buy all the new stuff. I like the new stuff. So as far as vintage Pez, um, it's really just the op what what we get the opportunity to buy. Like if we see something, we are trying to get one. You almost can you get it out of there without? You know? I didn't want to like mess them up. Um, I am moving my my uh, efforts to try to get one of everything obviously i'm not going to be able to get things like asterix and alpine man and things like that but um you know i want to make sure i have one of each thing and then start working on variations again but you know that's kind of like why i got i mean really the whistle's a variation i don't know the the wonder woman's a variation so I, maybe i'm not living up to that this week with the with the crazy variations <laughs> But uh, sometimes when we really like the puzzle, we'll try to get different yeah. ones in it. Yeah, uh, but I'm going to put that on. I can't see how many. Yeah, but I'm going to try to trying to get just one of each thing and there. then do variations afterward. Oh, look at those. I like that gold one. <laughs> uh. Yeah, those are cool. That's Ace Killer, dark red stem. 
nice. So these are Japanese mini pez. In case you don't know. Tim says, love the headers. Just bought some for my vending machine I bought. Oh. Nice. 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 Sorry. Said he just got it in last night, putting it together as we speak. What? Send us a picture. Yeah, send us a picture. Sounds super cool. Says the seller has one more for sale. Oh. Ah, beautiful. Beautiful. Let's see. I, I do wish that these came with the eggs. That's the only thing I'm missing. Yeah, the eggs would be nice. It seems like all... A lot of them I have don't have eggs. I wish they had the eggs. Someday I'll get some eggs. <laughs> I'll have to end up uh, get, buying some. Yeah. The eggs are readily available. There's nothing special about the eggs that these pests came in. Because well, I have a lot of them that aren't open, so I don't plan on opening them. What even <laughs> is this? Uh, I don't know. The, uh, there's no Pez in it. Oh. It's just the Peanuts one and it has uh, the little the insert. insert. And then, the and then card. this is so cute. The Snoopy. Snoopy had a card. I'm going to display this one. So cool. Yeah, I'm not buying, I'm not buying the eggs that from like Pez sellers where they're trying to like jack up the price because there were once Pez in it. In these Tommy Gotcha um, machines, like the there's there's the eggs are the same. So Oh yeah, you can get you can get them for like like a nickel an egg. Like they're yeah. super, super cheap. You can well, buy like hundreds of them. sell the eggs and then they have the inserts in them. And then and then like maybe the wrapper that goes around it and they ask for more, which makes sense. But yeah. some of the times there's seem a little price. If it's got the pest stuff with it, then that's fine. Yeah. But... Not just like an empty egg. The empty eggs aren't. I wouldn't say that they're worth that much. No, the eggs aren't worth anything. Oh, another one. <laughs> Are we, is this a theme? I think it's going to be the whole theme for today. There's still another box down there. A big one. A bean box. I'm surprised that they packed and shipped it like this because got to be expensive to ship this big Well, I think thing. you pay for shipping for every auction, and then they ship it. Then instead of combining it, they, um, they ship them out separate. Because mm -hmm. I'm sure you didn't get combined shipping, did you? I think I did. Oh, they did? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, if you did, then that's a good deal. I know, like they have serious packing. Oh. Says the egg colors were specific to the sets. Oh, yeah. There were. Yeah, no, I know there was like a little thing around them, but those eggs, they might have used a specific color or whatever, but those Tommy Gotcha eggs are like standard vending eggs. They, you can, in Japan, they like, there's millions of those Tommy Gotcha machines with like tons and tons of different stuff in them. Cool. There you go. These are... Pokemon one? That insert is super cool. Wait, this art... So I have two other ones of these. This has like little stars on it. So I have I have two other Pokemon inserts. This is my third one. They're all different. So, and then... I don't have any Pokemon Pez open. All my Pokemon minis are in the little bag still. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Yeah, Timothy, I agree. It's expensive compared to the weight of the parcel. 
Yeah, I mean, sometimes the shipping makes a big difference, especially uh, around the EU because the different, you know, the different, like you were saying here, um, I only buy in the United States or outside your country because the custom fees vary according to the countries and the contents. Yeah, I agree. Like, I get some, I get a lot of stuff from like Croatia and uh, oh, yeah. it always costs a little more and takes a little extra time. That is so cute. All right, yeah, well, we don't buy. We buy some stuff from overseas, but yeah, most of the stuff. Not a lot. And then here. if you do buy something from overseas, try to fill the box as much as you can. Otherwise, it costs a lot just to ship a couple things. Yeah, I'll have to look at my pictures from the last time I was in Tokyo to see if there's any machines in my pictures. I never looked uh, at that. Yeah. You bought me some fun stuff, but I don't think anything came out of vending machines. No. <laughs> These are super cute. Those are so cool. <laughs> I like Pokemon a lot, so it's pretty fun to get this. Yeah, those are nice. And they take up less space. Ah. <laughs> I like the mini puzzles because you can display them in front of like rows like this like on my display mm -hmm. shelf i put them in front of everything this little pikachu is so cute this little mudkip is like this one might be the cutest one <laughs> yeah, that's super cute <laughs> it looks so happy that's cute torch by the way, these stands, this stand and these, um, if you go to Pez 3D Prints on Etsy, you can buy these and also shoes, but you can get shoes from a lot of different people. Yeah. Um, well, these shoes fit this, so you can't use, you have to have these no foot shoes to slide in yeah. here. Like you can't use this for no foot Pez, but you can put your footed Pez in these little slots too. Like that's why... You see us like sliding them in the little slots here. Yeah. So if you use code Aaron collects Pez when you check out there on orders, I think over ten bucks, you'll get what is it, fifteen percent off, something so. like that. You'll get some. You'll get a discount <laughs> if you uh, uh, need some stands and stuff like that. So Etsy Pez 3D prints. Yeah. The stands are super cool. We use those like Pentagon ones like everywhere. Hey, we got something the Sunshine Tuna likes. Pokemon are really cute. Yeah. So, this is the. This is the. This is the cool one. Yeah. Wait. Oh. Is it? I hope it is. Yeah. I guess it's all still low. This is the this is the bank buster right here. I'll let you talk about these because I don't really know anything about them. What? What? There's two things in here. Oh wait. Oh, it's like dusty on my fingies. Whoa. I don't know why there's two. Wait. We got combined shipping. Oh, that's uh, that's what these are. Wait. Yeah. Okay, wait. What one should I tell first? I like how you're hiding them under the table. Eh? <laughs> these aren't that. These aren't that spectacular. But if you like uh, Japanese minis, then you'll. I don't have these either. Well, I do have. I do have one of these, but I can't. I can't open them because they're with that egg set we got at the Michigan Pez convention when they came in those like sealed eggs, but the Pez are outside. You can hold this up if you want. Oh, thanks. I will hold this up. You like my Vanna White today? So this is Rody. Rody. Oh yes, these are super cute. <laughs> I like this one a lot. Dude, look at. Wait till you see these pets. Look at this Rody on the back of the hat. This is Greg. Okay, this put them on the thing. Don't Greg try wants, to stick it in my Greg nose. Wants to get a cowboy hat. I do want to get a cowboy hat. You should go do that. I want to. Ah, uh, I'm gonna 
take the paint turpentine what do you call them? <laughs> and take the name off and repaint on their grig <laughs> <laughs> You start modifying those minis, there'll be a mutiny. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, what? Oh, they're so happy. Look at them. <laughs> those are cute. These are called the uh, roadie. Roadie. Oh, like, so I guess the horses are roadie. I don't know yeah. anything about that. See how these. they say it on the side? Roadie. Oh, yeah. The cowboy hat said Rody on the back. This says that the cowboy is named Rody. And the other one's a Rody horse. Rody horse, Rody horse, horse, horse. Butt check. Okay. Right, that's enough of that. <laughs> this one says it's juicy. It's juicy. Okay. All right. <laughs> Did I show this? I don't remember. <laughs> Number 12. And then there's the little insert. Yeah, it's neat. I do like how they have these like displayed. You could put these if I, you know how I have like the plastic acrylic things mm -hmm. and it holds holds a little header card. You could put these on like the outside of it because it doesn't fit in the space all the way, and then you could put that on it too. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Just when you think, uh, Rody with Rodies with the little cowboy can't get any cuter. <laughs> get frogs on top <laughs> yeah oh <laughs> am i doing it right yeah okay perfect are there horses or llamas they're horse they're horse this is roadie horse yeah they're horses i guess maybe that's what the horses look like in japan anime right these must be Japanese horses oh my gosh this one's crystal okay this is my favorite pez of all time okay move those other crappy ones off there <laughs> send these back they don't have frogs on them look at that wait look at that okay let me put this up here just, just check it out hopefully it's in focus right away it's pronounced roadie y look at that okay it's a crystal horse with a frog on it It's pronounced R Rod Y. Rod Y. Rod Y. I don't know. Roddy. Paul. I don't think I believe you. It's a Roddy. A Roddy. I'm calling it Roddy. Like like he rides the horse. I don't know. That's why I say Roddy. Like you. Wait. Look that that frog looks like what I would look like if I had a seriously <laughs> terrible sunburn. Wait, the frog needs a hat. I oh don't know. Gosh. Like the frog. I swear they have little. Oh no, they do have hats. I thought that was a crown. It's a hat. We need giant sombreros. Yeah, something. Like this little, or is that a cowboy hat? That's a cowboy hat. Oh. Oh my gosh, so cute. But that one's crystal too. Oh, are you saying it should be Roddy instead of Rody? Yeah. I think, I don't know. I'm not an expert at that. Those are. We'll look up the. Those are great. It says Rody or Roddy is a children's rocking horse, and the frogs are an original character designed by Bandai. Oh. Look, this has really great knowledge on it. Who likes the little frogs on top of the horses? <laughs> there you go. If I was this organized, my Pez collection would be, like, I'd get out one of these, I'd be like, just read this on the video. Mm -hmm. Yes. R Roddy, is what he's saying. Roddy. Roddy. <laughs> Sid says, you guys are killing me. Maybe, maybe what he means is he spent three years searching and we just bought him. Hey, buddy, you could have bought him. The Roddies? They had them on eBay. Just bid more. Nobody was bid. Nobody was bidding on them. My dad bid on them. these. My dad was like, "I'm not bidding on anything." Are you watching, Dad? <laughs> and then he bids on them, and then it drove the price up. So, yeah, 
that happened. No one else even been on them though. Aren't you glad he didn't get these though? Yeah, they're so cute. No, he said I could have them anyway. Just made me pay more money for them. <laughs> That's just a lesson. I don't know what the lesson was, but oh. message received. I don't know. These are so cute. I don't know why I didn't have these before. Paul but... says, be careful how you handle them. The frogs come off really easy. What? Really? Ooh. Take them off. <laughs> like, <book. laughs> you see, see me playing with the frog. Do, oh. do, 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 do. Don't worry. Gray won't be playing with them. No. Nah. That little orange and green one is so cute. And the pink and green. Oh, my God. Okay. One more. Okay. Oh, here we go. This is the one everyone's been waiting for. Oh, if you've bailed on our live go. stream, you're missing out on the bus package. I don't know how anything can beat the frogs with the Roddies. Did I get it right? Roddy, Roddy, froggy. Yeah, there's two in here. Oh, Sid says he has them all. Ah. Matt's researching to understand them. I'll be selling mine this weekend. Well, Sid, just message what? me. Just message I have me, them Sid. All. Maybe I just buy them all from you. Wait, what does all mean? Yeah. There's a couple that we want to get because we are hard to get. Yeah. We don't have them. Be like Kyle and just sell everything to cool. me that I want. Okay. Kyle's not here, so Sid's better. I'm just saying. <laughs> I have no idea what he's even saying here. I'm not going to put it on the screen because I can't understand it. He says, this is upon Nichols. Oh. <laughs> oh. That's upon Nichols. Home. But there's a dog hair there or something. That looks like you there. Oh, wait. Which one? The, the brown one. There you go. <laughs> Shouldn't make that face. Somebody might freeze frame it. And... Don't give an idea. What's this? Yeah. These are called these are called pond nickels. I don't know what a pond nickels is, but these are mini minis. Set number forty one. Here, just put these up here. These are mini minis, and the mini minis are the easiest to find if you have them. Then you should just um, send them over and I'll give you $20 for them. Look, that one's funny looking. <laughs> oh, I don't know. All my friends have low ride pairs. Do, 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 do. Okay. That one goes sideways. Oh. This one is a person. That's a P. I like the one with the scuba mask on. We can toss that one in the pool and see if it floats. Well, they'll all float. <laughs> Chubby. What's don't he do saying? it. He said a new meme, me making faces to uh. try to match these faces. <laughs> don't you do it. <clears throat> all right. So, yeah, these are stupid expensive, but we, no one will ever sell us any. So, yeah, I have to get, I have to, uh, Get mean on eBay. This says characters based on Japanese educational TV series. Pond Nichols one. Mini mini. Do you wanna? <laughs> I'm gonna. I don't do videos on these because I don't even wanna attempt to pronounce these names. Chimba Mimi. Gotcha pin. Gotcha pin normal. Gotcha pin driving. Muku and Pichan. Pichan. Peachan. Peachan. I like that name. Cool. I think we should create these for the other ones that you have too. Oh no, I like this. I think it's really neat. And then there's also uh, this this one. Can't get this there. Okay, just put it, do it later. Uh, 
Wait, this one doesn't have a card? Wait. Oh, no. No card? Wait. Did it? I thought it was supposed to. But it doesn't. It might not. Nothing else in here. That's oh. Yeah, are this is that a mini minis pine wrinkles card? I don't know. You know the you know the stuff about these. I don't really know anything, I don't about, know anything these. about these. Oh yeah, that is a mini minis. Yeah, the card has the mini minis on it. Yeah. Sid but probably there's knows. no uh huh. Hey Sid, we need the other junior city ones. I think Junior City 2. We need Junior City 2. Um, the one with the dog. Yeah. So just message me. We'll make a deal for what you have. Yeah. This says, uh, wait, where's the paper? Oh, we have it. Not packaged with candy. I like this little goat. We try to watch One Piece. Yeah, I did not enjoy One Piece, the anime. You're going to have all these haters coming after you now? I'm just saying, I just didn't like it. It's very popular. I like Isekai anime. Yeah. These are pretty cute. Yeah. I do like all the One Piece like merch. Mm -hmm. I think the One Piece merch is really cool. Okay. Ready? I know, Sid. I'll pay you appropriately for them. What does he say? He says Junior City 2 is hard to find. Oh. I think it's 2. That's the one with the dog, right? Yeah. Uh, Going Mary, Monkey D. Luffy, Nami. <laughs> so the light yellow stem is Going Mary. Stop it. There you go. Oh. The dark red stem <laughs> is Monkey D. Luffy. <laughs> the blue stem is Nami. The green stem is Ro Rorono, Rorono, Zoro, Zora, Rorono, Zora. And the pink stem is Tony Tony Chopper. The coolest name. Is it the coolest character? I mean, it must be. I like be. that little goat going Mary. I don't I don't know why the junior cities are, are so expensive. It must just be that they just didn't have as make as many of them yeah. or have, have be as widely distributed. I have no idea. Is that uh Yeah. These and these mini minis they're from two thousand eight, so they're like one of the last series that were made, but they're really hard to get too. Because I guess they didn't make as many, I don't know, or maybe by the two thousand eight people were just done yeah. collecting these. <laughs> <laughs> but the other ones that we got today they all say 2004 so it just goes to show like they made them for a few years yeah it looks like we didn't get a one piece insert yeah unfortunately that is kind of sad but because of because of uh these are probably really hard to get and then the fact that we even have that's pretty cool too the little insert so Sid dropping the knowledge on us. Junior City was made to complement back to school season and go. were only sold to machines in Junior City children clothing stores for a short period of time, not mass produced. Oh, that makes there sense. There you go. Dropping that knowledge. That's why they're like hardly any of them out there. So you have to go to like some garage sales in Japan and maybe you'll find one. Mm -hmm. There you go. <laughs> some sweet little kid took one home. Doesn't even know how much it's worth. <laughs> How much us crazy pest collectors will pay him for it. <laughs> then Paul adds, they lost the license, so no more will be made. Uh, yeah. Nice. That's a shame. I mean, they're hard to get, but if you buy them when they're more, you know, like when they're current and they're new, you, I'm sure you can get them for, you know, better deals than waiting 20 years or whatever 15 years for them to come out yeah however long it's been so 
Well, I think we uh, got enough stuff this week. What do you yes, think? Yes, we got some like, really, 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 really cool stuff. Like, I never, ever thought we would ever find these minis. And then they were listed on eBay. And uh, now at first I was like, we're not even going to... Like, we probably wouldn't even get them. But then Greg ended up bidding on them. And uh, super cool. You got to get them while you can. Yeah. I mean, I don't think they're going to be going down in value anytime soon, so... Depends if Sid decides to flood the market with his stockpile. Uh, yeah, you don't know how many people have or... Yeah. Or, uh... I mean, it's got to... They're expensive anyway because, like, when they first sold them, you put your money in the machine and you get one, but you might get, you one know... One of the same You one, have to buy a whole bunch of them just to get a whole set. So, I'm sure that, you know, made them cost even more. And then just being in Japan, like, you know... Yeah. It's far away. <laughs> And the shipping to ship all that stuff over here all adds up. Nice. So, all right. They seem really, really popular though right now. Like more and more people are getting into them. I remember even back when they first came out in like 2004 and stuff, going to pest conventions and shopping for them. And they were expensive back then. And I was like, I don't know if they were $30 a set or 50 but like... I remember seeing them in people's rooms for sale, and because uh, my sister always went pest, you know, the pest coaches with me, and she she would buy more sets of these than I did, because I was always like, I'm not spending like you know thirty fifty bucks or whatever for the minis, but uh, I wish I would have bought more back then. <laughs> but they still seem like a lot for. I, mean, I didn't have a lot of money to spend on, you know, pez always so. I'd rather have like a, you know, like I usually just bought like one really cool vintage dispenser or whatever, you know, here at the convention. Yeah. Do, Do I have, have ping beat? I have uh, one set of them. I'm not sure. <laughs> There's two of them, right? Uh, I feel like I have the one with, I can't remember if I have, because uh, I have the Snoopy one with the crystal. I can't remember if I have the Pingu ones with the crystal one. Paul says, sun's out, gun's out. Gotta go. Ah. See you later, Paul. Thanks, Paul, for joining us. So what do you guys think the next thing that we should get? Like, what should we focus on the collection? Not been a lot of Caspers popping up lately, which is depressing. Yeah, it's weird. It seems like there was Casper's. Well, you bought a bunch of those from some dealers and stuff. You probably bought them out. Yeah. It seems so, like those are... I bet you'll find some stuff. Well, I'll get some at the conventions. Yeah. Yeah. Especially Cleveland. There are going to be a tons of the big dealers there, I'm sure. This is these mini Pez were not popular in Japan. Yeah. Probably could go to these... Maybe these... Uh, I guess he's in... Are you, are you in Japan? Yeah, where are you, Collector Pez? He's got the Japanese Bubble Man. That's why I, I think that's the Japanese one, right? That's why I ask. Do 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 do, Collector Pez. That's all I think about when I see that. <laughs> the Make a Face. I don't really like the Make a Face. Do you like the Make a Face? It's okay. I just I think if you're gonna spend four thousand bucks on a Pez, there's a lot of cooler ones. Yeah, I usually like cute stuff i don't know i, I mean eventually we'll have to get one but i mean it is cool and it'd be cool to have one but like i don't like sit here and go i gotta get that make a face <laughs> i mean they were they were bought even then to collect i mean yeah. how many of these are we gonna see on card like yeah i see them all the time yeah so i just well, think yeah yeah i think you well we've been seeing a lot of them lately it seems like but i think you don't know who's, you know, like it just goes in waves, like who sells their collection or who has one to sell. But there can't be that many out, out of that, you know, out in the world. Yeah. Especially on card. And they have all the little pieces. N next week you'll see that I bought one of my bucket list ones. Wait. What? I bought, I bought a chunk of stuff from Joe. It's not here yet. Did? Yeah. I told you about it. Uh, you said you'd never seen one before. 
A lot of people have never seen one before. Wait, I don't remember now. I'll tell you when we're off. But um, yeah, so so I got a bucket list one coming. Not it's not a thousand, not even a thousand dollars. It's half that probably. Oh. But um, um, it's one that I wanted for a really long time, and it's going to round out one of my collections. So that I'm pretty excited about that. Oh wait, wait. You remember? Wait. Uh... I won't say it. Wait, I can't remember now. I mean, it's really exciting for people to watch you remember something and then not say it. So I'll just tell you when we're done. Um. So yeah. So I don't know if, if what else I want to collect. I mean, I don't think that I don't. I think I'm pretty much done with mimics. I mean, if one or two pop up every once in a while that I might not have, but I think I have them all or most of them. Yeah. Um. Got all the. Not all the pandas, but most of the easy stuff to find. Yeah, got most of the easy pandas. I guess I really need to make sure I have all the whistles because I, I need a lot of common whistles. Uh, like now that I know there's thin foot three nines, that's uh, something I can find, go looking for. So I'm sure you'll see a bunch of those on the live stream coming up. In the, I'm sure in the following you'll come weeks. across stuff at the conventions that you might. No, I know, but I just don't know what to focus on now. Uh, because. I mean, I need to fill ho holes in Casper. So there's two Caspers I need. Um, yeah, so I just don't know what else to buy. I want to get some more. I want to get more pop pins. <laughs> you do? Yeah. Hmm. I don't have. I don't, there's a bunch I don't have. Some of them are. Some of them are not too hard to find, but the people ask crazy prices. So like, when I found this gizmo for pretty good deal bought that and then uh but there's a lot of other ones like this gizmo that i think people just sell them for more because gizmo is like a popular character i don't know like maybe it crosses over to other collectors and the funko collectors too but i mean doesn't your, your dad has every single one of those pop pets doesn't he like do you want to get the stuff for golden freddy <laughs> do you want to get the same ones as him i don't know i like these a lot i like the little boxes and i think they're cool i want to hang them on the wall Okay. Because cool. I already hung them up, but I want to, I want to complete my uh, boxes. Yeah, I want to. I think so. There's a couple. I think there's one or two USA whistles I still need, and I would like to. Uh, well, I want to get a, a USA Mister Ugly and a USA Witch. Oh. Uh, so I do want to get those two things. I'm hoping I'll find that stuff at the convention, so because hmm. I want to look them over. Yeah. Um. But yeah, I don't. Uh, yeah, I really can't think of anything that's like I have a burning <laughs> desire for. Oh. Uh, you? Because you got the hippo. That was one. Yeah. And you got the red-headed panda. That was one. Yeah. So those were two the bucket list. Yellow head of panda. So I do still want the yellow head red stem panda, but um, I, I'm i going to get that at Cleveland. Oh, yeah. So... Um, So, yeah. All right. So let's wrap it up. Okay. So Sid reminded me that I have some business to do. He says he has a USA Mr. Ugly for you. Okay, cool. Well, we'll put, wrap that up in the uh, wrap that up in the minis that I'm, I'll buy. He says he's selling 15 mini sets. Okay. Well, so. you probably only have two or three to sell. Because <laughs> they're for me. Oh. Okay, so great stuff. I have to go kill some wasps. Everyone stand by for me. Don't set, kill the wasps. You didn't learn that today. Sales post selling 15 sets. So. Well, thanks, Sid, for joining us. Yeah, I appreciate it. We're going to uh, head off, too. I'm going to Great contributions go from relax. everybody, as always. Thanks for adding value to the community and the live stream. Yeah. So appreciate that. And uh, we will see you. Well, we will see you next Saturday. Aaron will see you on Tuesday with uh, some Spider Gwen action. Probably that, yes. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. See you later. See you. Bye.